every FNAF game explained in 60 seconds. First, FNAF 1 is the well renowned 4 animatronic horror suspense classic that's a little boring at times, but it's so iconic, so who cares? FNAF 2 more than doubles the action with 10 animatronics and no doors for a way more high octane, lovable, and scary experience. FNAF 3 cuts us down to one animatronic spring trap along with a few nightmare animatronics. FNAF 4 takes the classic gameplay loop into a bedroom, forcing the player to relive their nightmares in their own room. By far the scariest game yet. Then there's FNAF Sister Location, which while it gets a lot of hate, it removes the gameplay loop in a really engaging way of storytelling. Unpopular opinion, but it's one of my favorites. FNAF Pizzeria Simulator allows the player to build their own pizzeria while fighting legal complaints towards your building, because that's what everyone gets excited for when they hear FNAF, lawyer work. But a couple spin-offs and a terrifying VR adaptation later, finally there's Security Breach, where the game is turned into 3D, which while gorgeous to look at, is a big hassle to play through as a sneak survival game that is sometimes genuinely frustrating to play even casually. But that's